with breaking news tonight. The Vols have had 44 players out for the last few football practices, including today. Six on your side sports anchor Jordan Kramer hearing from head coach Jeremy Pruitt this afternoon. She joins us now with more. Had 2020 been a normal year, the Vols would have been on the field today at Neyland facing Charlotte in their season opener. 2020, of course, abnormal. So Tennessee football had planned to host their first inner squad scrimmage of the year at Neyland instead today. But in this pandemic, we've quickly come to realize sometimes the first alternative is just another idea eventually crossed off the list. So was the case for Tennessee. Jeremy Pruitt announcing today the Vols had to scrap their scrimmage as a result of 44 players players being unable to participate. Some were out due to injuries. About seven or eight were out having actually tested positive for COVID-19. But the majority that missed today were out due to contact tracing protocols, according to the third year head coach. Pruitt added that to date they've had 48 players who've missed at least 14 days due to quarantine, four of which were quarantined twice. Just trying to get through the, the contact tracing and and uh, you know when a guy missed this is 14 days of practice or 14 days of training, you know, starting over and it's kind of had a cumulative effect a little bit with some, a few injuries here and there, uh, nothing severe, uh, but some guys that's had to miss some practice time. So uh, it's definitely been challenging uh, and, you know, we've got to continue to, to improve as a football team um, and, and, um, you know, just figure out the circumstances and figure out a way to, uh, to be productive in them. The Vols canceled a scheduled practice last week as a result of a spike in positive COVID-19 test within the football program, but have since returned to practice four times now.